Wendy's new Big Bacon Cheddar Cheeseburger has arrived. It's got everything you could possibly want. Wendy's Applewood Smoked Bacon, our new creamy cheddar cheese, sweet bacon sauce, along with crispy onions on a bun that has cheddar baked right on top. What do other places have on their buns? Sesame seeds. <laughs> Real exciting. Get a bacon cheeseburger that offers a whole lot more when you order the Big Bacon Cheddar Cheeseburger through the Wendy's app today. I participate in Wendy's. Wendy's app download and registration required. Warwick Mayor Frank Picozzi is on the Seekonk Supply Hotline. What a tragedy, Mayor, but thank you for being here. I know you had a busy morning. Good morning, Tara. Good morning. Uh, you're not new to Warwick. You just happen to be the new mayor, right? So uh, you know as That's much right. as anybody else in the Warwick area that that is just a, a just a horrible spot right there. And what are your initial thoughts? Uh, well, we're just kind of um, grieving today for the for the child and for the family. I was down there a long time yesterday. Um, it was a very tragic scene. And I mean, uh, you know, I grew up right in the area. I've, I've seen it play out quite a few times. Yeah, and and how many signs can you put up, right? So it's not deterring people from saying, "Well, I'm not going to go swimming, but I'm just going to walk out to to the back, you know, to the bottom of the sandbar and overlook and whatever, get splashed with the water, and then it turns tragic." So yeah, I, um, I think it, the signs do deter a lot of people, but uh, it's still a lot of people go fishing out there. I mean, I've been out there myself. When um, the problem is, you get out so far, and, and when the tide comes in, it, the sandbar disappears behind you. And um, there's a terrible rip current there. It's just not a not a great place to go. But uh, a lot of people do. I mean, we probably hundreds of people a day go out there. So, but but anything can happen. So yeah, it, absolutely, it should be. Is it? Do you think it should be all or nothing? I mean, if if people are going out there hundreds of people a day, that's not a good numbers game to play, right? No. Well. Uh, you know, I, I'm not sure how we could prevent people from going out there. I mean, they, you know, they have access to the shore. It's, a, it's their right. Um, I don't think we can close it down. I, I'm, you know, we're, we're going to assess the situation after, you know, we've gotten past this. Yeah. It had been talked about years ago to maybe dredge the area. And I hear what you're saying, the, the access to the water, the access to the, to the beach or the shoreline. But you have, I don't know, other places say where if it's dangerous, I don't, I'm thinking of the bluffs, I'm thinking of cliff walk. There are deterrents for you falling off, right? The, uh, you know, say the cliff walk or, or certain other places that you can go around. This just seems signage is one thing, but to just be able to walk out there, like you said, it's so tricky because it's just a rogue situation, and then you turn around, there's no sandbar, and it, you get sucked in. Um, right, exactly. Can you dredge that area? Has anybody talked about that? I mean, I know this is new on your turn, yeah, um, if you want. I, I don't think that, that's ever been talked about. I'm not sure if it could be done. Um, you know, maybe the Army Corps of Engineers or something. I, you know, it's a very unique area. It's, um, I don't know if it would form again. I don't know if it would hurt the ecosystem. I'm not sure. Um, it's something that I certainly never pondered. Okay. Um, how about a lifeguard? How about security, safety? Would Would anybody talk about building a fence, which probably wouldn't even last there because of weathering and salt and whatever? No. Um, no, I, I'm not sure about that either. But, um, like a, putting a lifeguard there, it's not a beach. I mean, you know, that would take a lot of resources. Um, actually, this year we, we were having a hard time even getting lifeguards. Um, right. There is a beach down there, but it's not in this area. It's a much more tranquil waters, and um, uh, you know, currently, I, you know, we're we're a few short. We just can't get lifeguards. It's not just us; it's other cities as well. Right, um, park ranger. You know, I'm just trying to think of any way to deter yeah. people. You have to have a presence there. The the signs are not working 100 percent, right? No, I, I agree. Uh, I, you know, it's a situation I'm going to look at with, the, you know, the experts, with, with our EMA director, the, you know, the fire chief, but we have to get past the search right now. Um, oh, certainly. That's kind of what we're focusing on. Certainly, certainly. Um, All right. You know, it was, it was very sad down there being with both families. Um, uh, the last I heard, the two men that were pulled from the water were, were in the hospital. I'm not sure. If, I don't think – I haven't heard anything, so I think that's good news. Um, and tragically, the man that um, who's a hero, um, you know, we found his body yesterday, and nothing on a little girl yet. They're still searching. Do you know if the three they, – they were all men that jumped in to help the girl, right? Um, yes. And do you know if anyone was related to her? I'm not sure about the two men that were at the hospital, but the man that um, the, the man that we lost was not related to her. He was a different, came from a different family. Oh boy, and 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 certainly is a hero for sure, Mayor. You 
Absolutely. You and, um, you know, his family was down there for quite a while. And when, and when he was recovered, they, they left. And, um, you know, we interacted, uh, um, you know, somewhat. They, they came over and thanked the firemen and the police. And um, uh, the family of the little girl was just, cut, you know, they were very, they were, you know, in shock, I'm sure. They, they were in mourning. I, I mean, the, the mom, it was very sad. She was just standing at the water praying. Um, the chaplain of our fire department came down. He was able to give her quite a bit of comfort. He stayed with her for a long time. Mm. Were there it, any other kids like, with it, her? It's horrible. It's hard to even imagine. No, oh, it is. It's. I have had. I have a tough time spitting it out of my own face today. Do you know if there are any other kids with her? She just ran down the sandbar. Was there a, a scenario that anybody... The, the, the family had some other children with them. Mm-hmm. Um, and, you know, it, it was quite a large group. Yep. But, Are they you know, from they, our... They, no, um, I understand um, they were from Massachusetts and Providence. They weren't from Warwick. Okay. And they were all getting together for, I, I would imagine, Father's Day or just to, to get together? Father's Day, you know, a, a family outing, a, a, day, a fun day in the, in the summer. It, it's just tragic. I, there, there are no words. It's just horrible. As a father and a grandfather, I can't even imagine it happening. I can't either. Um, so the, the, there were a couple of families there. They were all together. And did they describe it? If, were there a, b- a bunch of people on the sandbar or just a few people? And were the, were the men in the water? Because that's not really the place to swim, right? No, not down there. No, um, I, uh, you know I don't have all those details because it's we were just witness. You know we were counting on witness um, re- uh, people recalling uh, what they saw, um, and I guess it was a panic. So I'm not really sure. I mean I don't know what the police got from the statements, but you know I, I just have a general sense of what was happening. Because I, I didn't get down there till about by the time I got the call, it was, you know it was probably a half hour after the incident happened. Yeah, it really is a tragic scene. So immediately there'll be no, there'll be nothing changed there that people could physically see. I mean, the signs can't be more. The signs are there. They're in different colors. Um, yeah, I, I know. Um, like I said, we're going to take an assessment. That'll happen soon. Um, right now, uh, you know, we're, we we have to go on with the search. Um, it's not something we're going to run down there and do today. Um, Because I'm sure there are family members around. I'm not sure. But, um, you know, we're going to do an assessment. We're going to look into it. Yeah. Mayor Picosi, did I just lose you? Warwick Mayor Frank Picosi? His phone dropped. Okay. If he calls back in, tell him thank you for his time. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna squeeze too much uh, more time out of him. I know he's busy, and it, and being down there, I can only imagine he he saw all the emotion with the families of the little girl and the and the gentleman who definitely is a hero trying to save her. M- my personal fear or concern is, you know, if it's not even you can't. If you look at the area, you can't like rope it off, but block it off in some way i mean there is an investigation obviously involved but you know that people you know we've i've done so many stories over the decades uh, and you say you know oh we're having a hurricane say so you know hunker down get prepared stock your water you know whatever and you know stay away from okay Okay, uh, and stay away from, you know, watery areas or whatever, but people tend to always go down. Mayor Picosi is on the line for a final word. I was just saying, you know, when you have crazy weather or something like that, and you warn people and you warn them, but they'll still go there. So my concern is it's certainly not an area that you could rope off there for right now during this whole recovery and investigation. But, you know, as long as, as we know that, you know, because we, we don't want to challenge people to, to go and see, right? Like, oh, let me go see what that's all about. Because some people want to act up and they want to tend to go where where they want to see what it's all about in danger. So currently, though, nothing f- physically looks different there. I mean, obviously, you have crews there, uh, recovery and investigation. But is there anything else different there that to keep onlookers away? Oh, I'm sorry. I had gotten caught off before, Tara. I had lost you. That's um, okay. No, I, I mean, we have the police and firemen down there right now. Um, I haven't been down there yet this morning, but, um, you know, yesterday there were, you know, a lot of people just sitting and watching. So, you know, we asked them to move along. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's, that's what I mean. You don't want people to uh, be, be hovering around or just want to do it as, a, as sort of a, a challenge kind of a thing. How about anybody that wants to go on the sandbar, even though you're asking them not to, but if they do, well, it, it, does it say do not go on the sandbar? Or are you saying by law and by environmental rules they can go there? Yes, they can. We can't, we can't re- restrict access to the shoreline. 
I mean, How about we, saying you have to have a life jacket on? Is anybody you know, tossed I, I don't know if we could do that, give that restriction either. I'll look into that. But yeah. I mean, last night, um, while the search was continuing, we had people going down. It was getting dark, and they had their lawn chairs, and they were going out there with coolers. It's, it's not oh, something we can, we can tell them they can't do. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Well, yeah, more signs, I guess. <laughs> I just, wow. Well, that's, more yeah. signs. That we'll, we'll see what else we can do. I mean, I want to... Um, we have to research it. Uh, you know, it's, uh, uh, it's been a long time problem, and I don't know if we can ever solve it, but we're certainly going to look for more different alternatives. All right. No doubt we'll probably regroup later, and I know that the families come first right now. So thank you, Mayor, for your time. Appreciate thank it. Thank you. Mayor Pocosi. Mayor Frank Pocosi of Warwick.